ZZ Top have had the same lineup for over 40 years. That is impressive, but are they releasing new music in 2021? I don't actually know. I assume not. AFI have amassed an impressive 20-something years with the same lineup, and they are releasing new music in 2021. Their 11th studio album. Guitarist Jade from AFI joins me now. Jade, thank you for speaking to the faction. Thanks for having me. That was not designed to be an attack on ZZ Top. They're great, but still, it's what? I think it's nearly 25 years with this four in AFI. Were you all in high school when you when you formed? Yeah, I mean, like I said, like you said, I wasn't in the band initially, but we all from the same town and we were in high school together. So we were friends. So, and I was in a band, you know, at the same time. So we kind of grew up in the same scene. Now with this new album, Bodies, it's out on the 11th. From what you've given us so far in these singles, there's a gothic punk feel. It's a crisp recording. Can you tell me about where it was made and how it was made? Uh, we started kind of making things at home in the last couple of records is because the technology has gotten so good that you can, rather than spending $2,000 a day in a studio, you can do it at home. So I recorded everything in this room, um, except for the drums we did in a studio and Hunter did his bass at home. And then I got everything together and put it together to do my production. And yeah, it was, it's, I love it now. I used to hate it. Twisted Tongues in particular is an interesting song. You're really making Adam work hard on the drums on that one. <laughs> and is that a bit of synth that I hear in that particular song? Uh, probably every song has at least a little stint, like some layer or something. So it's just kind of like, I really love doing that and kind of doing sound design type thing. So, yeah. Is that you that writes and orchestrates th those synth effects? Yeah. Is that something you've always been able to do? I mean, kind of like right after I joined the band, I started getting, I got my first copy of Fruity Loops, which I don't use anymore, but you know, I started like learning to do programming and making electronic music and bringing that into AFI. And so, yeah, uh, I've been doing that for many years now. Was that a difficult element to bring to AFI? No, I mean, it's been a really a kind of critical part of our music for like at least 17 or 18 years now. So um, it's kind of become second nature to put that in. We put it out to our listeners about what you'd like to ask AFI. And a lot of the responses was quite simple. Just what is it like to make music after all these years? I know it's a broad question, but if you're able to provide some insight on what it what it means to you to be able to still make music that touches people more than 20 years on. I mean, I, I always trip on this on a daily basis that I'm still not only able to do this for a living, which is incredible, you know, for a band to be together this long. And I never take it for granted that we can do this and that our fans allow us to continue to do this and and use our passion to create this music but also that the fact that i still love to do it you know you think i would be tired of it and just kind of see it as a job at this point but i just love writing music and i do it every day and i still am driven to do it so it's pretty incredible when you do hit the road i know everything's a little bit to be to be confirmed in 2021 how how many members do you have in your touring band because Generally with AFI, we can hear other guitar parts. I know there's only one guitarist, but how many touring members do you think you've got these days? That's always been just the four of us. There's nothing, nothing, nobody else behind the curtain that's playing parts and you can do it all by nope. yourselves. I mean, we don't, we don't recreate every single layer that's on the recorded sound because, you know, I kind of like, it's kind of like what the Beatles said when they made Sgt. Peppers. It's like, they stopped caring whether they could re It's like the studio is the studio. And live is live, which I kind of feel like, why hamstring your recorded efforts? Because you're like, man, can I recreate all these parts live? So I don't worry about that. Just go out there. When we, get, we hit the stage, we're like more of a punk band. You know, we just four guys playing music. See, that, that comes to me as a shock because I listen to the music and I think, and I listen to the live sets and I'm thinking that there must be, there must be somebody, you know, a lot of bands will do that. They'll have somebody side of stage, whether it's playing some acoustic parts, whether it's playing some effects. So that's very impressive that you're able to do that on your own. AFI Bodies, it's out on the 11th, but if you can't wait, you can listen to a handful of the songs on that album already. Jade, thank you for speaking to The Faction today. Awesome, thank you.